her sin, which was, you know, uh, the gospel was preached to her when Yahweh, the word of Yahweh, which was his son Yahweh Shai, spoke to her saying, Your seed would um, crush the head of the serpent, and the serpent would bruise his heel. Nevertheless, you need to bear fruit. You need to bear seed. You need to bear a uh, man child. You need to, you need to produce uh, in order to be saved. And childbearing, you shall be saved. Okay? And childbearing, Eve shall be saved. How was she saved through childbearing? She was saved when she bore the Messiah. And that was the fulfillment of the Most High's promise to Eve in the gospel being first preached unto Eve. So oh, don't worry about it, sisters. But they could do you a little bit more grace than calling you Eve and reminding you of your sins. Why can't they call you a daughter of Abraham? Why can't they call you a daughter of Sarah? Why you can't be a daughter of Rebecca? Huh? Why you can't be one of them? Why you can't be the daughter of Zion? Huh? Why you can't be the daughter of Jerusalem, black woman? Who GMS want to call Eve to remind you of your sins? Well, GMS, according to your 12 tribe chart, the so-called Negro is Judah, which would make that so-called Negro woman a Judite woman, a Jewess woman, a Hebrewess woman again. So why can't she just be called the daughter of Zion? Nah, because that that's too much love for you to express. You you you, you don't want to show you know you you bitter uh you know you bitter sinners, you bitter hypocrites, you 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 know what I'm saying you leaven Pharisees man and you you false prophet scribes. You know, you guys don't got no uh, salt in y'all doctrine. Y'all don't got salt in y'all doctrine. It's too much for you guys to show a sister some love. All right? She can't be Jerusalem. She can't be the daughter of Zion. She can't be Jerusalem, the mother of us all, can she? Nah, that's too much. That's too much for these uh, false prophets that the nation of Israel following today over here in America thinking they got themselves some righteous teachers and some righteous elders. All right, but we're going to get some more scriptures because we're going to get a good precept about that real quick, okay? Yeah. All right. Yeah, yeah, you knew I was going to cut you. Even Steve, you might have not posted the comment, but I don't care if you posted it or not. You, uh, I mean, you didn't make that video. You reposted the video under... Your, your channel. So when I first saw the video, I thought it was something that uh, GMS, GMS, uh, GMS F, SF discussion channel had posted. But until I looked further and saw that it was the elders on the East Coast, perhaps, that posted it. But that's okay. I cut your ass first, Evil Stevie in the gang, uh, SF Bay Camp, because I thought you guys posted it. And when I saw it, and I was already fed up because I had already been throughout previous days watching other uh, videos posted up by Great Millstone uh, depicting uh, the daughter of Zion as Eve in order to uh, degrade her and to uh, remind her of her sins, okay? So I, I blast back at uh, GMS SF first. Uh, and I don't know, I bet, I, I bet you it was even Steven who responded to talk about her, you, am I offended because y'all called her Eve? Hell yeah, I'm offended because you called her Eve. It's not that Eve uh, is a dishonorable name to call any woman. Uh, but I know the connotations that you, you're, you're implying when you call her Eve, man. I know what you mean. You, you mean what that scripture just told us. Eve was deceived and in transgression. And that's all you want to remind the black woman of. It's her sin and her transgression. So she won't be the daughter of Zion to the 12 tribe chart gospels like GMS, ISUPK. All right. She won't be the daughter of Zion to these fellas. I'm letting you uh, sisters, you know what I'm saying, quite aware that the most high do hear uh, the reproach of your accusers. All right. He hear the blasphemy against these damn tares who can't even have enough 
you know what I'm saying, ump about themselves to give a little spit of blood to prove that their DNA came back from you, Mother Eve, and not from the Neanderthal. All right? Because a lot of you niggas gonna come back from that Neanderthal, a haplo group. Why you trying to get on the daughters of Zion and, and my, my sister's out of the house of Judah, making her remember her sins by calling her Eve. Well, bless is she among women, man. All right? Yeah. Yeah, Mary. Blessed is Mary among women, who was a Judite. Was that Eve? You niggas gonna call her Eve? What about Mary? Why, why, why? You know, matter of fact, that's my wife's name, Miriam. And I know some definitions will say rebellion, but others will say beloved. All right? And you can get a little bit of rebellion out of your wife. We saw Miriam got smitten with leprosy. We know that that rebellion do apply to the sisters. But don't forget that she's also beloved. And that's the reason why the Lord saw Mary fit to conceive his, his child, all right? Because she was beloved of the Most High, man. What, 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 what was it? Uh, blessed are ye among women, beloved, all right? Among women, all right. Praise the Most High. All right, so now let's, since we can't get these false prophets to acknowledge our sisters with any th words of grace, let's let the scriptures uh, edify and exhort the sisters Alright With some words of grace And we're going to have some salt in ourselves To show GMS How to sprinkle a little salt In their doctrine In order that the sheep might be able to eat that bullshit That you're trying to feed them, okay Yeah, straight up Let's go to Joel chapter 2 first 